a beautiful Saturday morning. Rain tomorrow, so I gotta get stuff done today. So I got the van cleaned out with the help of my neighbor once again. Um, he just ran over here and started helping, so as always, do appreciate it. So got this cleaned out, got the boxes cut up, so those can go in the trash. Um, this thing is. I don't know. I'm going to put this on Marketplace, see if I can get a bite out of it. Get a bite on it. Um, it's just too hard to roll around on this stuff. And, I mean, as cool as it is, uh, I got a couple pictures of it. So I'm going to set that up there and if I can get a grand for it, which is what I paid for it. Um, so I took a picture of the front of it and then I opened up that to show the two big batteries and charger and all that shit that's built in so maybe I can get rid of that so this little tote of stuff was in there a couple batteries battery backups um, I gotta talk to the owner up there and tell him that I don't buy ballast um, there's probably five or six of them I saw <clears throat> so I don't want to pay for junk you know and that's that weighs up I uh, got a made that longer than it should have. Huh? <laughs> uh, so what we got? So we ended up. Whoop! That's the wrong pile. Hold on. Hold up. So this in that tote, and these three stacks of uh, laptops were in those boxes. So these, those, and those. Um, these here were all in there. Got an oldie on the bottom there. Not sure about that one there, but there's one there. There's three oldies there. <coughs> but, um, I also found two or three like this, so I have to tell them if they have covers on them, and you can see that there's nothing in them, then don't throw them in the big able box. I don't bitch too much because you know these guys are um, really good with me or to me so you know take the good with the bad I guess but uh, yeah see like here I don't know if Ford will buy that for something they ain't stick it in with like a ram stick or something so now I got that done and then me and my neighbor sat out here last night drinking beer and Gatorade and we separated all that white and blue wire so that's all cat five that's a dollar one a pound and here's all the white which is just PC wire so that is 35 cents a pound but you see how Really not much in there. I seen somebody on Facebook had a post. Is it worth stripping this? Uh, and it was actually this kind of wire here. It was Cat5 wire though. I didn't even give him a comment. So, and then this here is done. I got the ends cut off of those. They are in there. So this is uh, 80 cents a pound. It's a 45% wire, they call that. Uh, but I still have... That tote to do. I gotta cut the crap off of that. That box to do. Those that box, that tote, that box, that box, that box, that box. And there's some on the other over here on the other side. So I gotta dump that other crap in there. And then this is PC wire too that was in here. Uh, yeah, this here is all hooked to mices, mices, mouses, and there's some more cap wire in there I gotta go through. So I'm just gonna tinker around out here today. There is some stuff I wanna put in the house that don't get wet. I wanna keep these. Um, they wanna keep this stuff here. I think this is why that's up here. Yeah. 
I got a whole tote of uh, office phones there. I got some more to throw in there. Uh, that switch there has got to go downstairs. There was a couple switches in that in those uh, Gaylor boxes, so <clears throat> put them downstairs. And the rest of this is just basically scrap. It's just trash, shred. Yeah, cover this back up. And I got some wagon wheels. My uh, neighbor's daughter asked if I could have them. She should take them. So I take them. So I was just talking to a guy that was out here next door, and he said they're probably just going to uh, do a little bit at a time and clean it out and probably just flip it. So the house will be up for sale if anybody wants to be my neighbor. So, that's my plan for today, people. Um, you see, I wanted to take tomorrow off. But, the problem is, the more I look around, it's probably not going to happen. It's probably not going to happen. Uh, if it's going to rain, I'll just go downstairs and... Uh, where is that? Probably just go downstairs and computers or something I just have I say I wanted to go to Ohio by the end of the month but I don't think that's gonna pan out I don't think it's gonna pan out that was into the abyss but we'll see what happens I still have to do uh, some uh, ice series I have to get packaged up and uh, I have a box that's already packaged up and ready to go, but I'll send them all together. Um, I don't know what to do with these boards. Uh, I have to send Chris a picture. He didn't have no comments on my video, so I'll send him a picture of each one and see what he says. So I know where to put those. So, yeah, so I got a few to do few to do and yeah I know I'm losing money but I took all the boards off these hard drives I might tinker around with those cause I ain't got nothing else to do matter of fact here's all the boards IDE SATA <clears throat> and I'm also hoping keeping my fingers crossed that I get no calls uh, next week <clears throat> other than that boiler other than that boiler because um, I want to like I say get some stuff done I gotta make a clean that off a little bit to figure out where to put some stuff I don't even know where half my stuff is because when I brought it from the garage it's a little bit of everywhere so I have to, uh, is that blue? That is blue. I have to find a tote for those. But, uh, yeah, I got stuff everywhere. So I don't know where half my crap is. I got the main stuff that I can work, so. <clears throat> I guess that's a plus. Who knows? All right, guys, so I'm going <clears> to <throat> get outside and get stuff figured out. It was actually funny. The uh, the guy who was next door had his <clears throat> wife or girlfriend with her, and she runs out of the house with, like, two or three rolls of Christmas wrapping paper. It was funny, so. going on here. I guess those are all the same. I don't know. I think about renting a small storage unit just to put my board sort of stuff in. Uh, when I get a couple of full totes, just take them over there 
and store them until I'm ready to go. Um, if I can pay my bills just off of a shred and aluminum wire, I'll just get a huge load and rent a little bigger truck and take it down there. That'd be kind of cool to do. Kind of cool to do. I still don't know what to do with these damn things. They're basically breakage. I see the E-Way Spencer went in the breakage the other day on his video. I was kind of laughing. I said, that man has the right idea. And he didn't even take like the... It still had the uh, heat sink and everything in it. Motherboard was still in it. That one's got a big old graphics card in it. And I have probably four or five of those. And a bunch of odds and ends at the... Uh, at my yard that was on a pallet I saw yesterday when I was there so <clears throat> um, my neighbor's thinking he said tomorrow but then he was thinking maybe Tuesday um, you know for that boiler I kind of like to just go and get it done and as they're taking it apart just get it out of the way but we'll have to see what he wants to do uh, I'm just a remover of the scrap, so uh, if he wants to wait till Tuesday, then that's fine with me too. But um, we'll figure it out. I haven't seen a groundhog in a while, and I have been up since 4:15 this morning. So I'm probably just gonna tinker around with this wire, get some of this stuff done. Um, all the garbage cans are full, so I really can't produce any more city trash. Well, I can actually put a little bit in the neighbors over there yet. Um, so once I, if I get all the wire done, I might just do these one, two, three, four, five, or six of these monitors. Might just break those down real quick, and I can throw those monitors in the trash can. Because <coughs> that's the way we do it around here. Ugh. And I am trying to work out a, uh, or I should say I found a, a house a few blocks away. Um, they want 40000 for it, but it probably needs 30000 in work. <coughs> so... I sent the uh, agent a message and asked if the owner would do a land contract with, you know, maybe uh, 15 or 20 down. Probably 15, but then the rest of the money would go in there. It needs uh, a kitchen counter. It has like a gra granite countertop, but it's got this massive Grand Canyon crack going all the way along it. Uh, it needs carpet. Uh, not sure what else it needs but it's a four bedroom house so I can get a couple of roommates maybe get a couple of roommates ran out a room or two but like I said they only want 40 grand for it four bedrooms one bath it has a basement and a two-car garage so um, If you guys want to look it up, it's on, uh, uh, where's it on? Zillow? I think it was on Zillow. Uh, the address is 8220 Hudson. H-U-D-S-O-N. Warren, Michigan. So if anybody wants to buy it for me, get on it. Get on it. And they're having an open house today there, and it's only, like, for an hour. So, I have way too much crap to do to... By the time I get over there, it would be a... Hey, that's an ice series. Ah, series. So, yeah, I'm going to go and look at that. Maybe. i get a minute. This ain't even an ice series. Oh, yeah. I7... 4770. That's worth $5,000. The memory of the little caddy wampus. I will take that and put that in the house. Um, 
Chris always worries about the I-Series being out in the rain, but all these Gaylord boxes and stuff are uh, inside. So I know the rains ain't hit this one. <clears throat> oh, Lord. I'm ready for a nap. And I think it's only like uh, 10 o'clock or something. 10.30. I came out here at uh, 9 o'clock and started... Uh, Smashing stuff with a shovel in the garbage can. <coughs> Busting up all that uh, plastic from those monitors. So I can get some room in the trash can. <sighs> Alright folks, I'm done. I'm going to put these over there where they belong. And grab a Gatorade and clean this wire up real quick and go from there. That's my plan, Stan. So, enjoy your weekend. I'll probably see you all tomorrow. And happy Scrappy Irish is a live stream. So, take care. Stay safe. Talk to you all later.